Hi everyone! Welcome to another Oil Painting 101 video where I will be teaching you how to glaze. Glazing has been used by oil painters for centuries to enhance the luminosity and depth in paintings. So what is glazing? Glazing is the process of adding semi-transparent layers of oil paint mixed with medium to subtly tint your painting. To help you better understand, let's use the example of the color purple. Say I wanted to paint something purple, one method is to just simply mix together pink and blue to make purple. But with glazing, I would first start off with one blue layer, let it dry, and then add semi-transparent layers of pink over the blue. Layer by layer, the blue is gradually tinted to become purple. Notice how much more vibrant and luminous the glazed purple looks when compared to the non-glazed version. In order to glaze, we first need a medium. My favorite medium to use right now is the solvent-free gel from Gamblin. I love its goopy consistency and fast drying time. I'm loading my brush with the gel medium and then mixing it with a tiny bit of burnt sienna. Make sure you only use a tiny drop of paint, otherwise the glaze will be too opaque. You can test the transparency of your glaze by painting a few sample strokes on a plain white surface. Notice how my strokes come out with barely any color on them. This is what you want. In order for glazing to work properly, make sure the layer underneath is completely dry. That way the colors don't end up accidentally mixing together. Now I'm just going to lightly apply the burnt sienna glaze over my dried oil painting. I like to apply my glazes in the areas where light is transitioning to shadow to make those areas more saturated and fleshy. As you can see here, glazing is not about making a dramatic change. It's about subtly tweaking and enhancing the parts you want to bring out. Now let's make a permanent rose colored glaze using the same method of mixing the gel medium with a little bit of paint. And again, Test your glaze to make sure that it is at the desired level of transparency. I like to use the permanent rose colored glaze to subtly add rosiness and warmth to the cheeks and nose. It adds a very endearing quality to my characters. Most oil paintings will have several layers of glaze, and you can use your own discretion when determining how many you need. Some artists start off with a completely black and white underpainting and only rely on the semi-transparent glazes to gradually add color over time. This will take many, many layers. I'm a little bit more impatient, so I start off with a colorful underpainting and use the glazes to bring out areas where I want the colors to pop. The difference is not huge, but to me, it brings out so much more life to the painting. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope it was beneficial to you. And for more videos like this and daily art updates, works in progress, and tutorials, please sign up for my Patreon page at patreon.com slash happydartist. Thank you guys so much, and I will catch you in my next video. Bye!